Hello, everybody. I'm back. I know I've been gone for almost, uh, almost, I haven't done a video in like six months, but I'm finally back. I, it's been a lot of things happening in the past six months. I've moved, I lost my job, I got another job and all that. But I'm back and I'm gonna do a haul video, or not, I'm gonna do a haul video later when I get into final stuff, but I'm gonna do a collection video because I've uh, moved, so I put up my collection, but I also got a second shelf with more stuff. So I guess without further ado, let's let's get into it. I'm not gonna take too long, but uh, let's get into this so we can see what I have in my collection. And let's start up here with the statues. We got the Batman and Joker. Awesome statue, it's very cool. I really like that. And Assassin's Creed. Here we got Max Payne. Unfortunately, it's kind of should be like that, but it's always been very bad. Another Batman from the video game, obviously. Here's a book. Here's Lady La Muerta. Some more books. Uh, we got the Punisher and obviously Rick. And here we got, let's go, the labyrinth with Simon, Simon Stolenhoff, a Swedish guy. Let's put that book over here. We got some art prints that have come with, with books, Kickstarters and stuff like that. Here's a very cool book. And here's, here's it's, it's an... Um, art book called Obliscura. I've done an overview of that. You can go back and check. Here is uh, Lone Wolf and Cub, the gallery edition. Here we have Marvel Knights Fantastic Four, one, two, three, four, the uh, Greg Morrison series, Doctor Strange and Doctor Doom, Triumph and Torment, Superman, The Many Worlds of Krypton, X-Men versus Avengers and X-Men versus Fantastic Four. It's an awesome book. Shield, a complete collection by Jim Steranko. <clears throat> the Trigon Empire volumes three, two, and one. There's a fourth volume coming. I'm gonna go through these in my haul video so you can get a closer look at them. Those are very, very cool books. The Shield. Uh, Artisan edition, and finally, Amazing World of Superman. Just gonna put in, so now we can actually get into the shelves and what I have. Let's go through my omnibuses first. You can see the Dark Tower, then we got the Cap Brubaker, Captain America, Doctor Strange. More Doctor Strange, this is volume one and two. Obviously, volume three just came out. So I'm gonna get that one, obviously. Name War by John Byrne and Jay Lee. The Deadly Hands of Kung Fu, Volumes 1 and 2. And then we got Shang-Chi, Master of Kung Fu, Volumes 1 through 4. Tomb of Dra Dracula, Volume 1. I'm still hoping that they will reprint Volume 2 and 3. Hellstrom by Warren Ellis. The Conan stuff. The Conan Barbarian Volumes 1, 2, and 3, and the Savage Sword of Conan 1 and 2. Obviously, I'm way behind. I'm never going to catch up there, unfortunately. Incredible Hulk by Peter David. I'm woefully behind on that one as well. This Volume 1. Fantastic Four. This is the Fantastic Four by Byrne. Volume 2 is being reprinted and coming out later this year, I think in November or December. Werewolf by Night. The Garth Ennis Punisher and Punisher Back to the War. So that's the Marvel omnibuses. We're going to DC omnibuses. We got House of Secrets Volume 1, Batman Brave and a Bold Volume 1, and Swamp Thing, Bronze Age Edition. I got a couple of more, but I got them in another place. So moving on to Dark Horse, we got the entire run of Conan, Dark Horse, the entire run. That includes all the miniseries and everything. That's the entire run. Plus we got Polar, 
volumes one, two, and three of Polar. That's some awesome artwork. Here we have Wolverine, the Adamantium Edition. I've done an overview of that. We also have Fantastic Four, this uh, gigantic edition, edition. I think I've done an overview of that as well. Freaks of the Heartland, uh, Alien Defiance, the uh, library edition. Sod. Sword Daughter, volumes one, two, and three, the complete volume of that. Predator, the Essential Comics, volume one. This book is a book I love. The Killer, the complete collection. They're coming out with a new volume of, of The Killer, which is so awesome. We have The Best of Panther from uh, Dynamite. Very old school stuff. This is basically from the Warren comics. And also from Dynamite, we have Red Sonia, Ballad of the Red Goddess. And we move on to my Usagi Yojimbo run with the art, the Stan Sakai project it's called, which is basically an art book where different artists have a good done there. Um, paintings of Yosagi. Look at these two. By the way, those are so awesome. And you have the 35 years of covers, which is basically all the covers that have ever been done to Yosagi Yimbo from single issues and collected editions as well. Very cool stuff. Here we got more Yosagi. Uh, this is Yokai, in this beautiful little hardcover. We got the IDW first two volumes. I'm not gonna get in the ori origins, as it's called, the other series, because that is this stuff, but in color. I'm not getting that. Uh, the Turtles book. And then we go into the Fanographics run. Then we, once again, we have the Turtles, and then Yusagi Yimbo Saga volumes one through nine, and the mini series stuff. Next up is 47 Ronin by Michael Richardson and Stan Sakai. Richard Stark, Parker, The Score, this is an awesome book. Got Justice League and Black Hammer, High Crimes, Black Beetle, Rashomon, uh, Our, what's this called? Our Encounters with Evil, some Mike Mignola stuff, Joe Golem. Just today, they came out with the Joe Golden Omnibus. Berserker Unbound by Jeff Lemire, Mike Dudato Jr. and Baltimore <coughs> Omnibus Volume 1. Moving on to some uh, absolutes. All-Star Batman, the uh, Alex Ross Superheroes, Long Halloween, which is... I've done an overview of the editions I have of Long Halloween. Then we have the black and white noir Long Halloween. <sighs> Orion by Walter Simons Omnibus. Crisis on Infinite Earths. Earths. Uh, Deluxe Edition. The Jonah Hex Omnibus. The Swamp Thing by Scott Snyder. The Atlantis Chronicles, which is such a great book. Such an Awesome artwork by Esteban Morozzo and written by Peter David. Moving on here, we have The Question, The Deaths of Big Sage. We got Wonder Woman, Dead Earth. We got Joker, Killer Smile. This is the uh, Jeff Lemire stuff. Batman Damned, Superman Unchained. Uh, this is an awesome book. The Swamp Thing uh, Roots. Roots by Terror, yeah. <clears throat> Uh, this is the uh, Clown Prince, isn't it? This is called Prince Char Dark Prince Charming. I only have only have one volume one, unfortunately, so far. We got, got uh, more Batman stuff: Dark Knight, uh, Golden Dawn, Batman Unwrapped, the uh, Corvallis, 
Batman Noel, Batman Death and the Maidens. This is the Eduardo Risso Black and White Noir Edition, Batman Hush Unwrapped, Killing Joke, two editions of that. Yeah, I had three, but I gave one away. Batman, the 1989 movie adaptation. I, I bought it when it came out. Yeah. Uh, Manhunter, Archie Goodwin and Walter Simonson Deluxe Edition, Night Force by Gene Colan and Mark Wolfman, Hellblazer, the 30th anniversary, Superman Man of Steel, Volume 1. I think there are up to four volumes of that. This is the John Byrne run. Um, yeah. Wonder Woman by uh, Joel Thompson. Then we got the New 52 run of Batman and Detective complete in complete run of both of them in hardcover with the, with the tie-ins as well. And Joker by Brad Estrell to finish that one off. Then we go to Black Mirror. We have uh, the Batman's, Batman's Grave. We get Joker, a celebration of 75 years. And we got Dong Joy, Vietnam 1965 by Joe Kubert. This is about the war. Superman Earth 1, volumes 1, 2, 3. Batman Earth 1, 1 and 2. Wonder Woman 1 and Teen Titans. One and two I should get Batman volume three and also continue with the Wonder Woman two. Also get to, should get the Green Lantern to get a complete one. Uh, Injustice volumes one and two and then volume two volume one. You, yeah, you, you get it. The Batman Who Laughs. We got Dark Knight. Tales of the Batman. This is Gene Colan volume two. Gotham. Central. I got everything else. I got the entire run in trade. I also got a hardcover as well. Batman Europa. And then we move on to 2000 AD, which is The Fall of Dead World, Volumes 1, 2, and 3. Those are such awesome books. You can see there's deluxe edition size and they're just beautiful. <clears throat> Here we got... Batman the Cape Crusader, Volumes 1, 2, and 3, and Batman the Dark Knight Detective, Volumes 1, 2, and 3. I got another volume of that, but I'm, I'm going to show that in a haul that is coming. Then we got my Punisher Epic Collections, those that are out. Uh, they have not released anymore. There are a couple of missing, actually, but we'll, we'll see when they ever, ever release those. Daredevil Visionaries. This is the entire Frank Miller run. And we got... Daredevil by Bendis and Daredevil by Brubaker. Uh, complete runs of those are such good books. Amazing books, honestly. <clears throat> Some of my absolute favorite stuff. And we got a Kickstarter. This is The Craving or The Empty, says she like, by Kristin Gerlitz. Wrote this. Here we have another Kickstarter. Songs of the For. Ah, it's called. Songs of Giants, which is about Howard Burroughs and Lovecraft. Star Trek, City on the Edge of Forever, which is amazing. Uh, Spawn, this is upside down, Jesus. Spawn Origins Volume 1, the hardcover. I got like up to Volume 5, I think, but they're in uh, Resistance in Trade. Oh, this is the one I got in hardcover. The fade out, I have the trades and I have the uh, first issue in this pulp magazine style, noir style. Criminal, volume one, nail biter, volume one, G.I. Joe, the IDW collection, volume one, The Valiant. Then we got the Punisher Max. I have the entire run in trade, but these two volumes that are in this hardcover, I couldn't get in trade, so I had I got this. But I have the entire run. You're gonna see that on the next shelf. Thor and Loki, Blood Brothers, The Marvels Project, Daredevil, End of Days. We got the Marvel Art of Conan the Barbarian. The God Butcher storyline from Thor by Jason Aaron. And the Tomb of Dracula. 
uh, Masterwork Volume 2 is coming out in about a month or so. <clears throat> Moving down here. Giant Killer by Dan Brereton. I got that on Kickstarter. Batman the Animated Series, uh, which is an art book basically about, about it. Six, uh, Lone Sloan, I got another book of that. It's coming in my haul. Here's another Kickstarter, Blacking Out, which is an amazingly beautiful book. It has a ribbon as well. Such a cool book. You got that one. I got all the, the prints that are up there. Most of them belong to this. This is a great, great, it's a crime book. Great Kickstarter. Yeah, I'm proud to have this one. And it's a, it's a deluxe size, as you can see. We got a Modest Blaze, Spirou. Another Kickstarter. This is Bloody Hell, Bloody Heel, Bloody Hell. The, uh, so I got some art prints with that. Clayton McCormack. This was another Kickstarter that took a long time to, to, to get, but finally got it. Uh, moving on to Books of Magic, we get Prison Ship, we got The Other Side by Jason Aaron, which is about the Vietnam War as well. G.I. Joe The Silent, Interlude 30th Anniversary. Another Kickstarter, this is The Mountains of Madness. Beautiful book. Another Kickstarter, and this is Catch and Release, a murder book story by Ed Brisson and Lissandro Esteheran, Hassan Ostame, Lahu, and Nate Cosby. Sorry for if I pronounce the names badly. The Elric volumes, um, Valiant Mass Traditions, Ninja and Bloodshot. This one is very cool. I love this book. A case of murder, a slight case of murder, and other stories illustrated by George Evans. These are very old stories. Really old school stuff. Very cool. Believe. And it has such texture here on a book. Amazing texture. It's absolutely beautiful book from, I think it's Fenograph. No. Let's see. Yeah, Phenographics. Some more um, Masterworks, She-Hulk, and the Fantastic Four. And then we got Godzilla Treasury Edition. Beautiful book. <clears throat> Judge Dread, the Case Files, Volumes 5 and 7. The Complete Calvin and Hobbes. Beautiful collection. And... The Complete Life and Times of Scrooge McDuck, a beautiful two disc, or two, two, two volume slipcase, Calvin Hobbes. You can get, these are the soft cover versions, but you can get those in hard covers as well. <clears throat> so that's the first shelf that we've gone over. Pretty basic, and let's go through to the second shelf. First up, we got some books here that are gonna be in my haul video. Including, as I said, in Lone Sloan, we got Ryuko, Volume 1, Gamma Dragons, Hagakure, Butcher of Paris, Batman and Cape Crusader, as I said, we got Chronicles of Call, Kung Fu Dragon, Richard Dragon, Kung Fu Fighter, and Why the Last Man All Complete. Then we go through here. Got basically my all my manga stuff here. I don't have a ton of manga, but I do have some. Here's a lot of the Kickstarter stuff that have come with the Kickstarters. And for some sort of newsletter. And another WWF, as it was called back then, just in the 12 magazine for some reason. A uh, this is pretty cool. This is from uh, Assassin's Creed. Got some movies here, as you can see, but we also have some other stuff. More, this is all my single issues. As I, said, I don't have a lot of single issues, but I have some. Some Kickstarter stuff there. Here we have 
Let's do my Gishiden. Volumes one and two. I thought I had one more. Berserk volume one. There's Tsumagishiden volume three. The Girl from the Other Side. They've come up in, in a beautiful uh, hardcover, so these two volumes. It's absolutely stunning book. <clears throat> G.I. Joe Omnibus. Here's, here's a Kickstarter. I did an overview of that. The Dark. Uh, Swamp Thing. We have the Bloody Stumps Samurai. Very cool. Very, very bloody, by the way. Okay, let's sit like this so we can actually see. Oh, ooh. I don't, I don't know. Here's M by Tessica. The Boys. 20th Century. Oh, Jesus, it's upside down. 20th Century Boys Volume 1. Blade of the Immortal. Volume 1. We got Monster. Two volumes of Monster. Uh, Master Keaton. Three volumes of that. Vagabond. Volume 1. And Grendel. The Grendel Omnibus. Volume. First volume of that. And it's just movies and shit like that. Like, I don't know. Samurai 7. Millennium. Entire series. Volumes. Season 1, 2, 3. And we got some Batman stuff. <clears throat> Move on to the important stuff. Some of the uh, volumes to release of Usagi. Here we have Samurai Executioner, volumes one, three, four, and five. Unfortunately, we never got volume two. Path of the Assassin, one and two. Lone Wolf and Cub, one, two, and three. And talking about Lone Wolf and Cub, some single issues for Lone Wolf and Cub. Volumes, let's see here, seven. Eight, thirty-one, and thirty-five. <laughs> uh, Loki, He-Man, Masters Universe, the mini comic collection. These are stuff that came with the uh, figures, the action figures, the toys when you bought them. Frank Frazetta's Adventures of the Snowman. The Modders Batman. Here we got Marvel Zombies. It's a book I want to get rid of. It's so awesome. I love it when it's in this landscape format. It's a bit different. Kill All Monsters. Sword Quest. Now what do we got here? Punisher, Daredevil and Punisher. Another Kickstarter. Awesome artwork. A man named Frank. Some more Punisher. Single issues. Punisher 2099, long issue one. And then this is pretty damn cool. Marvel graphic novel, Kill Raven. This is Marvel graphic novel number seven. The quality isn't great anymore, but it's just great to have this book. I picked it up really cheap. <clears throat> let's go on to the actual shelves and let's see what I have here. Oops, sorry, sorry. Five Ronin, then we have Avengers Endless Wartime. We have Spider-Man, Family Business, such a good book, such a beautiful book as well. Carnage USA, Astonishing Thor, X-Force, another book that I want to get rid of. Um, Avengers Disassembled. I got this in, this is the Wolverine by Jason Aaron. I have one in, in, in a hardcover, a lot of them, other of them in trade. Fear Itself, Spider-Man, which is such a good miniseries. The rest of the Fear Itself was bad, really bad, but Spider-Man was great. Doctor Strange Season 1, then we get to search Doctor Strange Volume 1 by Jason Aaron. <clears throat> the Jason Aaron Punisher, which I also have in trade, of course, to have a complete run. Now we got the Captain America, Moon Knight, Thunderbolts, Daredevil, Noir, The Dark Tower. This was before I picked up the, the Omnibus. 
Cloak and Dagger. And this is Cloak and Dagger, Child of Darkness, Child of Light, which is a really cool book. Doctor Strange Into the Dark Dimension. And Nemesis, then we go into my thick, like epic style collection books. Defenders Epic Collection, we got a Doctor Strange Epic Collection and a Star Wars. We got World War Hulk, we got Captain America, the Marvel Knights run, complete one here, volumes one and two. The first one is so good. John Cassidy artwork is just stunning. Spirit of Vengeance, Ghost Rider, Man Thing by Steve Gerber, complete one. Doom 2099, the complete collection by Warren Ellis. Daredevil, Typhoid's Kiss, Machine Man by Kirby and Ditko, Son of Satan Classics, Monster of Frankenstein, Planet Hulk, and then we go into my Punisher run. Punisher in the Nom versus the Marvel Universe, Suicide Run, Shadow Masters versus Wolverine, Eternal War. We got the Essentials, four volumes of that. I love the Essentials. I'm so sad they disconnected the Essential run, the Essential line. I don't have a lot of them, but I have this one, these ones, this one. I have these ones and I have a couple of others, which I'm gonna show you a bit later on. Then we go into my, more of the Punisher stuff. Welcome back, Frank. Warzone, Born. Uh, Punisher presents Barracuda, and then we get the entire Punisher Max by Garth Ennis, which goes from there through there, then we get Punisher Max Untold Tales, The Platoon, Fury. Then we go into the Jason Aaron run, which I said also had the hardcovers of. Uh, the Greg Rucker run. The Becky Cloonan run. It continues with the Edmondson run. And then the Rosenberg run. So you see I have a lot of Punisher stuff. And it continues with a lot of... A lot of Punisher stuff, and it continues all the way here, where we have uh, Tomb of Dracula, Visionaries. That's the ones that are out. Then we got more Tomb of Dracula, Daredevil, Born Again, and Daredevil, Man Without Fear. Marvel Horror, and Spider-Man, Craven's Last Hunt, which is so good. Savage Sword of Conan, and Conan the Barbarian. <clears throat> more Marvel trades, including Thor by Straczynski. Trials of Loki, we got Mighty Thor by Walter Simonson, Volume 1. Uh, Thor, Goddess of Thunder, we got Winter Soldier by Brubaker, the Brubaker Captain America run. As I said, I have the complete run. This complete run of Captain America by Brubaker in trade, in hardcover, and in omnibus. So I got the complete run, but in different formats. And more Captain America and Black Widow and just a bunch of Marvel stuff, including like Electra Assassin, more more Electra. Uh, yeah, this is a beautiful series. Such a good series. It's uh, Gabriel Del Mundo artwork. Such an underrated series. It's so good. <clears throat> Includes the vision and stuff like that. Moving on, more Marvel with like Taskmaster and Marvel Atlas. Yeah. And West Coast Avengers or Avengers West Coast. So it goes into more Marvel here. You can see Phantom X, Mystery Men, Hawkeye, Ghost Rider. Then moves into DC. The Animal Man by Jeff Lemire, New 52 run complete. All-Star Western, New 52 run complete. Uh, Superman, Lex Luthor. The Lex Luthor Man of Steel, President Lex. Superman Red Sun, and the, uh, this is the uh, Bendis run on Super. Superman, the man who is super. Just gonna put those in and we go down. <coughs> More DC. This includes Justice League Dark, complete run of that. Green Arrow by Jeff Lemire. Now we got Green Arrow Year One. Uh, Green Arrow the uh, Rebirth. And Green Arrow and Green Lantern, that classic run, which is so good. 
with the Longbow Hunters, Watchmen, Suicide Squad, and the Silver Age, which is not the Suicide Squad you see on and read today. It's very different. Very different. I prefer that to what we have now. The Demon by Jack Kirby and Hellblazer. This is volume five. I also have volume one. I don't have a lot of Hellblazer. I do have some or Constantine and stuff like that. More DC. That includes like Batman Gates of Gotham and Tales of Demon, which this is a really, really good book, but it's been recolored. And I hate when they recolor books. It makes it look just stupid because the art is great, but I'm gonna hate when they recolor books. More Batman stuff. What happened to Kip Crusader? Yeah, 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 a lot of Batman, of course. You laughs, year one. What do we got here? Gotham County Line. Batman Robin. Time of the Batman, right? Batman and Son. Time of the Batman. And we got those. Yeah. Uh, more Batman stuff. Talking about it. Tales of the Multiverse, Batman Vampire. Uh, just as you can see, a lot of Batman. Sandman Mystery Theater. Coming up with the compendiums of those. It's the big ones, big volumes. It's going to be very cool. Astro City, 100 Bullets, Black Orchid, Terminal City, House of Mystery, Hellblazer, Trinity of Sin, this is the Phantom Stranger. We got some Constantine, Jack Kirby's Forever People, Beware the Creeper, Hellblazer and the Rebirth. Uh, okay, then we move into my other section, Independent Image. We got Kill or Be Killed. And the Fade Out, Southern Bastards, The Fix, Spawn, Lazarus, and then it's just random stuff like Revenge and, I don't know, Samurai's Blood. And I Hate Fairyland Volume 1, Tokyo Ghost Volume 1, Postal, The Wicked and the Divine. There's a lot of stuff here. <coughs> Fatal Volume 1. East of West, Outcast, or yeah, it's Outcast, right? And Sex Criminals, and Carbon Gray, and The Last Contract, which is such an amazingly good book. Saga, everything that's come out of Saga. That's far. Moving down here, we can go, we continue this, these books, Kickstarter stuff. And the last taste of American Crime. Well, we're at PI, there's more Kickstarter stuff. Last taste of American Crime. Uh, actually got some small thing here. The Unwritten. Saucer Country. Some White Last Man. Some Swamp Thing. Kickstarters. This gun work. This is Deep State. We got Diana. Darkness. As you can see, we got some Vampirella stuff. We got the man with no name. Masks. Some Red Sonia books. Sword Quest. Man, I love this book. Awesome book. Awesome, 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 awesome book. Here we got from Boom. Empty Man. That is such a good book. Dracula. Here's one of my absolute favorite books. Strange Attractors by Charles Soule. I talk about this book as much as I can. This is such an amazing book. It's about react, action and reaction. How you can change things without, without like actually doing anything. Hit. The Rinse, another one of my favorite books, God Country. Man, this is good. I would love to have this in an oversized hardcover. Okay, One Hit Wonder, another Kickstarter. Trigger Man by the guy who wrote uh, 
the Warriors, the, 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 the movie, The Warriors. Afterlife with Archie and Judge Dredd of America. And then we got into more. We got like Mr. X, complete collection. Share from Babylon, Ape Sapien, the immortal demon of Linda Blood, blah, blah, blah. Hell, Hellboy, X. Samurai, Heaven and Earth, The Massive, Cimarron in the complete graphic novel, Curse of Dracula by Wolfman and Colon. I have it in, in hardcover as well. The Tourist by Brian Wood, Tarzan and Planet of the Apes, and Judge Dredd and stuff like that. Northlanders, Black Hammer, Briggsland, more... Like, here we got some hardcovers. There's the Curse of Dracula in hardcover. Here's a Doctor Strange, but it's a soft cover. The Punisher Index book just talks about everything. Punisher Noir. You got some European albums. Marsupilami. More Marsupilami. Another, this is a Kickstarter, the Corsair. Blueberry, more blueberry. And older trades, some rise to midnight suns. It's cool stuff. And finally, finish off with Streets of Gotham. Volumes one and two. I think there's a third one. But here you have it. That's my entire collection. The stuff there is going to go in my haul video because I'm waiting for a couple more movies to come in so I can do the haul. Uh, but you have my entire collection here. There. Yeah, I'll put all this down stuff there. And the stuff there. So hopefully by the end of the week, I'll be back with a whole video for uh, movies and books that I picked up over the past six months. So, um, well, until next time, give me a thumb up and subscribe and tell everybody about me and uh, my channel and uh, hope to see you soon again. Bye, everybody.